Hello, I'm Steve Anderson here at Merrill Manufacturing Company. Check valves are basically a valve that opens and closes to control the flows, to keep the flow flowing in one direction. They close so it doesn't have back siphonage or back flow against a pump or, or some other application of some other appliance or something. It's to control the flow. And in most instances, they can be installed both vertically and horizontally. The only thing is if you get, say, an inch and a quarter or larger valve, then I would very strongly recommend that you go to a, a variable flow valve. And the variable flow valve has ribs on the inside, on the intake side, that helps guide the poppet that opens and closes and keeps it, if you installed it in a horizontal rather than vertical position, stored horizontally, the ribs will keep the insides moving back and forth and not get crooked and stick and operate the way it's supposed to. If you get a bigger size valve that doesn't have the ribs on the inside, which is most all traditional valves do not have a rib on the inside, then and you get bigger diameters, you have a bigger space and a, more of an opening for the stem and the inside of the valve that if you had any kind of debris or anything flow through, the, the weight of the poppet could get off center and could get stuck and not close correctly. So uh, most instances that doesn't happen, but it could. So the idea is if you're doing it in a horizontal position, it's much more preferable to stay with the smaller size valves. But then again, the question is what size valve should I use? Use the size of valve for whatever size the pipe is. So it's not like you change the valve just because you want to use a certain size valve. That doesn't do you any good. You really need to keep the size of the valve to match the size of the pipe that's being connected to.